Hi, my name is Jessica. I'm one of the nurse practitioners here at Titan Medical Center, and I'd like to talk to you about our newer therapy called ARIES or semi-glutide. Semi-glutide is a glucagon-like peptide, and it works by insulin regulation to help move the glucose into your cells to be utilized for energy and helps with fat metabolism. There's also an added benefit as it works on the receptors in the gut to help you feel full faster and suppress your appetite just a little bit. I also really like this therapy because it is just a once a week injection into the subcutaneous tissue. So for all those that don't want to have high maintenance but great results, our Aries therapy, the semi-glutide is the one for you. Call and text 727-389-3220 or visit our website at titanmedicalcenter.com. What's up guys, John here, I'm with my big brother Drew, and we are here in the Titan Lounge. It's Drew's first appearance back, with me yes. and him together anyway. Yes. Um, and you know what, today has been an awesome day, like usual, but it's been really, really cool because we received, I think, half of our load of jumpsuits. That's right, so Titan Medical Center every year brings out badass jumpsuits for our athletes, our patients that want to purchase them, and our staff and everything like that. So we're gonna open some of these boxes we got today. Yeah, very excited. You guys know I love my sweatsuits. Even if it's 80 degrees, yep. I love being in a sweatsuit. So yep. I can't wait. And again, they're all official Nike sweatsuits. Oh, yeah. Not cheap, no-name brands, quality right. stuff. The stuff I have three years ago, I'm wearing it today, as you can see. Yeah. Still wearing this stuff today, it's still good quality, so I'm true. very excited about this. It's true. So most are Nike. I did get a couple few off brands just to see how they were. I want to give them a shot, do some different things. But majority of them are going to be Nikes. Yeah. And they're all top quality, so either way, it is what it is. But let's go back and let's open some of these boxes, Let's Drew. do it. Let's see what's up. Let's go. Packed. So you guys get to usually see the glitz and the glamour of Titan Medical Center, right? Well, you know, we do have our workspaces as well. And this is just one of our workspaces where we hold a lot of the different promo items and set up the promos to go, pack everything up. So when the boxes all came today, right? Uh, I wasn't here. I'm like, listen, just put them in, in our, our promo room. So we've got these boxes here. All these other boxes behind here just came today too. About a thousand of the Titan Strong shirts. Oh, nice. Oh. Let's do it. All it's right. Christmas, Christmas and summertime. Let's start this side, right? You want to just rip, rip it open, Drew? Oh. Right. oh yeah. So we definitely got some good Nikes here. So we got the red and black. Zipper pockets. Yeah. Got the olive. Oh yeah. I knew oh. Drew, I know Drew likes yeah, olive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's all the back of that tight knot. That's so. my color with the blacked out tail. This is all like embroidered it. too. So I mean I mean we Ooh, did like a, is, yeah. a couple hundred of these jumpsuits. Yeah, nice. And the lady that's doing the embroider for me, she's like, You sure you want to do embroidering? That's gonna be a lot of money. And I'm like, listen, what else are you going to do? I can screen print it. I'm like, I ain't doing no screen print screen on this. Print, nah. That's going to crack. This is forever. Embroidery, yeah. is, that's that's long lasting, guys. Wow. You got to have long lasting quality. You guys man. can check out the stitch. And it, it's dope stitching, dude. It's real, it's, real stitching. It's on point, man. That's not going to iron off. No, definitely not. I mean, we got tons of these reds. We got this different blue, colors, please. like even this blue. Like, oh, yeah, that's this a shiny deal. blue. Like, come on, man. Like, where are you going to get Ooh, this from, dude? Even little. Look at that. Details like this. Look at that. that. Those yeah. are all reflective. So when you're running or something like that, it's going to be good. Now, wow. I know it's summertime, right? I bought these in January. I just had to collect them all and then get them all lined up and get them over there. And it had them for a couple months. But wow. I bought enough so we're going to be prepared for next December, too, as well. And I'll be getting more. But um, yeah, it's just gray. some of the stuff. Yeah, Ooh, I mean, black just, with the gray. I like that. Check that one out. I mean, I got all different colors, different sizes. That's Chicago Bulls, Chicago yeah. Bulls theme right here. I can't promise you guys I'm gonna have all your sizes like in each different design, but I promise you I will have all sizes. I just got, I'll have a lot of different color schemes. That's right. Really I bought a whole true. bunch. I just, you know, I just changed it up, sizes, styles. You know, I kind of kept to our zipper pockets. Yeah, to our our core red, black, blue, gray. But there are some owls in here. It's a different throw off. No, actually, this is one of the off brands that look like Nike. I like this. This uh. Yeah, it was it was a little bit different, I right? Because like it it's like not too thick. Yeah, yeah. So it kind of holds like your arms. Be, whoa, I like this. Side pockets. Oh yeah. Nikes will have those too, but this this is just one I did like a throw off. I was like, hey, listen, let me just try a couple different brands, see what's yeah. out there, because it was a little bit different. This will hug you. I like this extra here on the hood too. Yeah. It keeps yeah. you closed in. Yeah, so it was a little it's bit good different cardio, stuff, good right? Good cardio hoodie. So this one's a little bit different. 
Chicago Bulls coach. Reminds me of the old warm-ups, right? The yeah, basketball yeah, warm-ups? Yeah, the Craig Check Hodges three-point <laughs> right? three contest. These are yep, I got the blue one. Let's see what these are. Oh, these were for Drew, I think. Those they might be too huge. big. Huge. Yeah. Hey, look at this. Yeah. Look at the Jordan. Yep. Jordan. And the Jordan right here. I'm ready to go. <laughs> I'm ready to go. What size are these? So these are. I want them. These are a 3X. 3X, but it looks like a 6. 3X. Yeah, they do look like a 6. This is Jordan style. Jordan was always big, so I definitely got these suits these are real nice. in different sizes and stuff like that. If you look at the cut, too. Guys, look at the cut on this. That's nice, right? Like a, lot of, a lot of sweatshirts make your waist look boxy. Yep. See how it's tapered? Yep. So it can still show how fit you are, even yep. with the hoodie on. Now, most of these I got were slim nice. fit, guys. Now, slim fit, as far as the feel, that means you're probably going to have to go a size up from where you were at. So if you're an extra large, you're probably going to have to go to 2X and so on and so on. So just remember that if you guys are going to order this, that most of them are slim fit. So you're going to have to go a size up, all right? Or if you guys have really, really broad shoulders and a really, really small waist, yeah. slim fit's perfect. Oh, yeah. Tight and blue. Oh, yeah. So these were some of the Ooh, other baby. jumpsuits that we baby. used to get. Yeah, so these were um, these were ones we had like two years ago. Yeah, I remember these. They had nice. some more left, so I bought up the sizes I could that had all the sizes, and all these are small. Um, but these these fit really good. I know the girls in the office wear these. Yeah, ladies, you want to jump on these? These have been gone quick. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> our, our girls in the small office will probably take these. Quick. These are awesome. This one was a little bit different. Like it, right? Definitely yeah, different like as it. far as the style, the hood, the way it feels. So that one's cool too. The so colors too. yeah. Look at these pants. Yeah, I like even this tie, the string. Oh, yeah. Look at that Nikes. Yeah, they're awesome. I think here's a, oh, that's not the jacket for them. These are joggers, too. So, you guys look at the leg. So, your caps. Yeah. A little suit right there. Oh, that's clean. Embroidered, ready to go. So, Ooh. we've got, yeah, so these are Banana Republic. Ooh. These are what our, our athletes or ambassadors should be wearing at shows or wherever we're going to go to. And we've got all different sizes, so we do have a couple extra ones if you guys want an awesome polo, right? So, yeah, yeah, Banana Republic is good. Like you guys athletic, have, too. You guys have probably seen me wear the black ones at yeah. events and stuff. I wear a 2X just to give you guys an idea of yeah. what the sizes. So right. These aren't Nike, but I was like, man, these are like, these are pretty serious. Like, Whoa. I like them, right? Whoa. Try one on, Drew. I want to see if you're a 2X in these or 3X This in these. is a, a 2X. Two? Yeah. It's comfortable. Feels like almost nothing on me. Yeah. Yeah, this is comfortable. That looks good, dude. You see how it hugs his arms too? Not too much, but it's there. It shows the shape, but it's not yeah, tight. It's not, not too tight on it. It's too even. It's, I the three's probably gonna be the same length. Yeah, I like I like the camo look on it. Um, just but the that arms. snake skin like it's tight, right? Yeah. These were pretty cool because uh, they had the blue calluses and then the blue inside for Titan. Which is really, really awesome. Quality, baby. You're gonna, he's gonna love these. Olympia, I'm showing up with fresh sweats. Oh yeah, we all are. Nike official. I like these extra little pockets yep. and stuff. Got a zipper pocket there. Cause I lose everything. This so. one's shiny too. I like the shininess yeah. on this jacket. True sweats, like old Ooh, school. Right? Real sweats. Like, let me see. It's gonna be form fitting for sure, 100%. It's comfortable. It's comfortable. Right? Like the arms, right? the arms feel good. Like okay. see, it's still like yeah, not yeah, too yeah. tight. I just want to make sure. A little it's short, but yeah, it's a little short. That's the only thing about slim fit. They do. That's what happens when you got big traps. That's right. Always get zipper pockets, right? If you possibly can, because if you're like me and Drew, if you wear a lot of athletic clothes, you'll probably know that when you put your cell phone, your keys, or whatever it is, and when you sit, they'll as slide. As soon as out. you get in the car, it's going right in between the seats. Yeah. If you don't have those yeah. zipper pockets. Or if you're in a movie theater and losing yeah. it, and have to go back. I've had to do that once or twice. That's the worst. Grace. All right. Reflective. Oh yeah, that looks cool, right? That reflective is nice. Little details like that. Yeah. It's cool. And then here's like the matte, like light gray. Yeah, that's nice too. Both are dope, dude. I like that gray, original gray sweatpants. This is the gray sweatpants. Like the gym class. This is what girls are, are, are raving about when you wear them, right? Oh yeah, yeah the gray sweatpants. They want the gray sweatpants. So if you guys sweats, are out there, yeah. hey, you want your lazy look or you want some lazy look? Gray sweatpants. Gray sweatpants. So it's got the black, black and gray. Mm. Have zipper pockets, everything. Like once you have zipper pockets, then you don't. It's like, oh. Yeah, it's a big difference. Tighten on the back. Yeah, running, Nike running. Wow, these are nice. Wow, this is yeah, this is <laughs> these are nice. Same as same as the gray, but the black wow. with the reflective and the that shine just gives wow. it that sleekness to it. 
So this one's all black, right? This one's got the little gray on it. Look at that. That's sick. And then look at the gray in this one. I love the shine, dude. Yeah, Lost the other bit. If you're a blue guy, you'll have you know the you know, light blue and the navy blue in it. Yeah. <laughs> Try not. I'm gonna see how it works. Well, if somebody left their glasses in the box. Oh. I'll be contacting them to give them back their glasses, whoever it was. So. <laughs> yeah. No, this isn't going to work. No? Too nope. tight? No, I can't oh, even get that Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. All right. I love just sweatpant material. Yes. So you got the blue. Now, this is the first blue logo I've seen. Right? Yeah. And then I wanted to do some different stuff. So this one, when I could do it, and then I had the blue tassels and the blue on back. Yeah. I just see if it's for you. Drew's such a big guy. The first time when Drew came with me, right? I, I ordered all these clothes and it just didn't fit them right. So I'm like, you know what, Drew? We're going to- Little. <laughs> yeah. Arms a little. I go, we're going to, we're going to Dick's, right? Dick's Sporting Goods and pick out all this stuff and make you try everything <laughs> on so I can see it, remember? Just to see it. Yeah. yeah. All right, so these should fit, Drew. This one's pretty cool too. And it's got the blue on the back. So you see the blue, you see the front. Try this That's back. <laughs> it's, it's just that everything's good. It's just that. You gotta give him some length. It's so hard because his traps up here pull up. Pushes it up, yeah. Pulls up like this. So it's hard to get him thin. He's more of a standard guy. Some people need standard fits, man. Yeah. Unless it's truly tailored, it's yeah. tough. But I, I try the most. I think majority of the guys, no problem. Drew, Rodney, you <laughs> might have some issues. I got yeah, this one, this. the black one for you. Has so, this? Yeah. Oh no, I know that. This one's that fit your arms like that. Yeah. It's a different color with the navy on back. They're gonna be mad when they see this. <laughs> yeah, I, I really like this company. I really like the design. This was this was something I played with that wasn't Nike, and I'm like, you know what? I want to get some different looks because I love Nike, but it's you know it's the same stuff kind of every year. Or this is a little yeah, bit different. Is, They're never gonna make anything like good. this. It fits good. It looks good. If you have really nice arms and it fits your arms like that, it's gonna make them stand out even more. Yeah, it's gonna put yeah, so. You should be feeling good with the Titan therapies, and if you're not in Titan therapies, even if you are, you'll definitely be looking good in our, our clothing for sure, 100. percent Oh, these are gray. So this was another off-brand. Right? This um, is like what people like now, like that old-school gray. Yeah. Cotton. It's like super fluffy. So I mean, yeah. So you can be warm in this. I mean, you can use it anywhere. Yeah, and I, I listen, I've got the Nike ones right right afterwards. So I tried some of the off brands just to look how they are. But if you want Nike, hey, I got Nike. And I've got tons of these guys. Tons. The whole box is grays. So I probably got everybody's sizes almost, Card I think, in these grays. Huh? Yeah, it's like so well, those ones are those these are the uh are those the other ones? These are the other ones. Yeah, so that's the off brand. It's like a, the jogger look. And then when you look at Nike, I like that too. Both and you got this. Yeah. This is the old school. This is the way that the the, the sweats used to look back in the day. So, yeah, man, it, you know, nice. it really depends on what what you want here. But majority, I've got all Nikes in here, and it's gonna be like this. Either way, it tapers your leg a little bit, so you can show your shoe game off. Yeah. You're not going over it. Old school, we used to cover our shoes back in the day. Remember? Yeah. And plus, with this, you don't have that. Yeah. Wear. Yeah. It's nice. It doesn't have the band. Remember how like, your jeans used to drag and they yep. have like the split? Yep. Like in the back for sure. Yeah. Hundred like, percent. Get wet. This blue. was the off brand, but it was a uh, it was like a different like bluish. So we did like a blue and black on these. Nice. Yeah, it's like almost like a cobalt. Try this one out, Drew. This is a three X. Let's see how it fits on you. Pretty much everybody else I like, guess fit in these, but if they're too yeah. small, they ain't gonna fit on Drew. Yeah. It's you always that everything arms and everything. And the thing once I wear it, this will break yeah. it in. But this. Yeah, you gotta have the length. Some grays. Oh. Thick. Yeah. So these are the Very ones, thick. and these are probably gonna be the staffs. These are what I got from them. So they, I got them too, because they're always complaining they're so cold. That I got them this jumpsuit, which has Nike Air. It's even got in the hood. Oh, Air. Look at it. That might be the first Nike Air Titan. Yeah. So I want you to stay tuned. Check out all the new Titan gear that we got coming on. If you see a picture or something, you like it, I would call or text in. Just ask them about it. This Because we're not going to put all these on the website. I'm just being honest with you guys. These are limited edition styles. The Titan Medical Center gets, and we I do different ones every year. So if you want this year's limited edition styles, you should call or text now, give us your size, and we can tell you kind of what we have in stock. And we got way more coming for you. So when we get them, we'll show you guys in video. If you guys like something, call or text immediately because they'll be gone real fast, guaranteed. So guys, I appreciate you guys. 
checking out the unboxing here of all the Titan, of all the new Titan gear. Me and my brother Drew, rocking it. We'll see you guys on the next unboxing, and we got a ton of new stuff coming your way. So stay tuned, guys. What's up, guys? John here at Titan Medical Center headquarters in the Titan Lounge in beautiful Tampa, Florida. That's right, sunny Florida. And at this point, we are with Bridget, and she is modeling some of the awesome Titan Medical Center gear that we have with our standard and our good blue and white Titan Medical Center shorts. Those are our colors. And then we have our navy blue tank top, our burnout tank top right there. So, so these shorts are awesome for anything that you're doing activity-wise, going to the beach, the pool, anything you could possibly do, maybe even just wearing around the house. You're gonna look good and feel good in these things. They're gonna be stretchy and they're not gonna stretch in a bad way. So what do I mean by that? So when we were developing these leggings, I seen them and you know, for girls that were doing, let's say squats, they'd be in their leggings and when they squatted down some of the girls, the material would actually stretch and go white. Well, you don't want that. That's not an aesthetically pleasing look. So at that point, these don't do that. And these are gonna stretch really, really nicely. You know, like I said, throughout the day, they're gonna, they're gonna hug your body, but not be too tight on your legs. Um, you're gonna get really, really maximum comfort out of this for maximum performance and maximum comfiness. Who doesn't like to be comfy all day long and look good while you're comfy? We primarily do hormone replacement therapy. We do also do a lot of medical weight loss, detox, rejuvenation, um, preventative maintenance, as you said, through different vitamin amino acid therapies and detox and peptide therapies as well. And we do service nationwide, so we have a lot of patients. So it works great too, because then you don't have to worry about coming into the office. Um, if you do live in another state, we can still service you and um, take care of your needs that way. What's up guys, John here. I'm Sharice. And we're back with another Cupid's Corner. Before we start, let me just tell you guys how beautiful my wife looks today. Thank you very much, and I'm blessed. But today we're gonna talk about some tips and tricks, hopefully to help you guys out in your relationship. So over time in our past relationship, we've learned a lot of things. We've learned a lot of things from our relationship, we've learned a lot of things from our friends' relationships, and so on and so on. So we want to help people out there they are going through these relationship issues or want to make their relationship better and give us some good advice, some good tips and tricks to maybe boost that relationship up or hit those sparks or make sure everything is going the way it should be that's forward and not backward and not stagnant. So today is a really good one. I think it applies to a lot of people out there, especially in today's atmosphere. Mm -hmm. Money cannot buy you love. Money can't buy you love. They've been singing about this for so long, <laughs> talking about this for so long, but I see a lot of people still making this mistake. And mm -hmm. usually it's on the guy side. Uh -huh. Guys think that, you know what? I can buy love. I can buy affection. I can buy girls. And this I mean, is- you, you can buy girls <laughs> and you can buy other stuff. Let's yeah. not get you wrong there, yeah. right? But that doesn't buy the true yeah. heart of love. Right. 
That you know? unconditional love. Uh, you got to earn that one. That love that's there for you no matter what. Even mm-hmm. if the chips are down or you lose that fortune, mm-hmm. who's going to be there by your side, right? Exactly. And the other mistake is, is that some guys out there think that they can mess up or not be there and buy affections or buy time. So let's give an example of this. Mm-hmm. First off, let's go back to the previous statement. So a lot of guys I know out there, or some of the guys I should say, lead with the wrong foot. And what do I mean by that? The first thing they say is what they do, how much they make, and what kind of car they drive. Okay, guys. Now you put it out there already. Listen, I've got all this money. Um, I can do all these different things. And that's the first thing that they learn about you Mm -hmm. because you think that that's the most important thing. It's really not. I mean, yes, having money, having stability, having a good job, are all A pluses and good traits that a lot of women out there, or if it's vice versa, men out there would probably mm-hmm. look for in a woman, right. right? So at that point, it is a good thing to have, but it's not a good thing to start off with, especially in the first conversation or the first time you meet somebody. Yeah. Not until a little bit later on the conversation or if they ask you. And then if they ask you and it's too early, you gotta kind of question that too. Like, are you just worried about how much money I make and what kind of car I drive? Um, you can get around it. Just be like, so, what do you do? You yeah. The, the best that, thing. That, that, that's a common question, you know? But, you know, you don't want to go in and be like, so I got this and I got yeah. that. I know some guys are like, I got this watch and I got yeah. this thing and I bought that the other day. And yeah. it's like, you know, sometimes the real true girl that you're looking for, they may not care that much about that. They're going to look for other traits that you might have right. that whether you had money or not, it's irrelevant. It's always good, you know, I mean, just looking at a girl, right, and then having a conversation and talking about what are your likes and dislikes, right? I mean, these are some common things, maybe some common things that you guys are there doing, whether it's uh, you're in the mall and you're shopping or you're at a museum and looking at paintings, right? So it's kind of like just starting the conversation, like, you know, what do you like? What are you into? What do you like to do? Like some of these different things, instead of just leading off with, I'm a doctor, I've got... (laughs) 10 million no. in the bank, I've got a yacht, I'm gonna take you out sailing, you know, like, okay, this is cool, <laughs> we, right? We get a tan on Sunday. Right, right. <laughs> um, and then the other point, the other point is this. So if you're in a relationship and you're blessed with money or maybe you're not blessed with money and you mess up or you're not around, right? You're working all the time continuously because listen, we know we gotta work, right? We gotta work to make money, livelihood, to pay the bills and to feed ourselves or our children or significant other. No, no. So at that point, <laughs> you know, when you mess up, let's say you missed a, a big anniversary, right? Oh man, you better get some gifts. Let, let's not, let's not, <laughs> let me, let me back this up because that is a bad example. If you miss an anniversary, you better buy like three gifts. Okay. So yes, money could buy your anniversary back. So let's go there. But if you mess up, let's just say it's a very common one, right? Let's say you cheat. Ooh. I can assure you that flowers are not going to fix that, okay? So you can't go and buy or you take them for like, let me go get you a new purse or let me go buy you a car or let me go and get you something and you think that that's just going to make it all right. Everything after that is going to be peaches and cream. It doesn't work that way. You are going to have to regain their trust. That's what you have to do. Money doesn't do that. You have to do that. Money's not going to buy them trust. You can't buy trust either. So, I mean... It is what it is. You know, you're not going to be able to buy love. You can't um, be with somebody and then take them shopping sprees and not spend any quality time with them or not do anything with them and just keep buying them a bunch of stuff. Be like, well, I got you a diamond bracelet and I got you these diamond earrings and I bought you this purse and whatever it might be. I mean, honestly, I'll be totally honest with you. Like me personally, I didn't. I even told John when I first met him, and this is true statement. You can correct me if I'm wrong. I told him, I said, I don't care how much money you got. Like, I don't care. Like, I want to make sure, I, I said, I want us to make good money. This was back in the day, way before Titan was even thought of. I was like, I want us to be stable. But, you know, if you're not never around, it's irrelevant. I was like, I'd rather be broke and be able to spend time with you and you have to spend time with our family than have money and you not be around. And now, I mean, I, I was honest about that. I really meant that because I, you know. Love him so bad. <laughs> the bonding time was what really makes a relationship, right? This is with your wife, your fiance, your girlfriend, or somebody you're just starting to date. Mm-hmm. Uh, the time that you spend builds that connection with you guys. 
So it's hard not to have time with them and to build a real true connection. Mm -hmm. Even with the world we live in today and the environment where you know you might not be able to travel and see people or whatever it may be, you have to do it over a phone. I mean, yes, you're having some communication with them, you're spending some time with them, but there's nothing like being with them, touching them, holding them, hugging them, and having and creating these new experiences. You guys are going to do things maybe you've never done before or doing things you like to do together. There's no substitute for that. Um, and like I said, there's exceptions to every rule to a certain... To a certain I mean, like, we percent, totally love right? gifts. Like, let's not... Like, I'm not, I cannot downplay yeah, this. Yeah. I really do like gifts. I like gifts. I like <laughs> diamonds. I like purses. <laughs> I like shoes. I like stuff too, okay? So let's... We need to be realistic here, right? Because girls do like it. Wait. You can gift them. However... This doesn't buy the love, right? Because right? then guess what? Then you build a whole relationship on materialistic things. Yep. That's not a real relationship. I mean, I guess it could be if you want to just keep buying stuff, but it's not a real heart-to-heart -heart relationship where you guys are actually connecting. It doesn't create love. It right? doesn't. It doesn't create love. Uh, it can accentuate love. Like, you know, if you really you have an anniversary and you really want to buy a nice anniversary gift or their birthday or whatever it may be, or you're thinking just off the head, hey, listen, I'm going to get her flowers. They're going to appreciate that, right? Mm -hmm. And they're going to love that gift that you give them. But if it's to make up for something, it's going to be a hard one. And they might take it and accept it and be happy for that moment. They'll take it. But they might be thinking in their head differently, right? And you don't know that. You're just like, oh, well, I gave this to her. It's over with. Thank God. I'm out of this. Let's go on and move on, <laughs> right? And it just, it, yeah, right. It, it never happens. <laughs> it, they might be happy for that that small little minute. Oh, and then, I love this. And then later on, it's like, oh. Uh, Two days later, you know what? I'm still really pissed about this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so this is just one good tip for you guys, and it's a long, That's a good one. long tip from a long, long ago, right? Mm -hmm. They've been saying this forever. Songs, those old wise tales. So money cannot buy you love mm -mm. at all, right? Mm -mm. So I hope you guys understand this, you guys utilize this, and if you guys do got money, that's a good thing, right? But don't lead off with it either. There's other things about yourself that you're probably gonna wanna lead off with because that's really gonna find your true love. Yeah. So I'm John. I'm Sharice. And this sums up another Cupid's Corner. Thank you guys for joining us every Sunday here on ABC, 11 a.m. If you guys missed it, Try to DVR, or you guys can always hit YouTube, just search Titan Medical Center, and you guys will get all the Cupid's Corners you guys love, and you guys will get to listen to it all day long if you want to. <laughs> so we'll see you guys next week. See you then.